following is a presentation of the Pro Wrestling Report. Informative, entertaining, and real since 1998. Welcome to PWR Ask the Booker, answering your questions about the inner workings of pro wrestling each week. And now, let's find out which question was selected for this week's episode of Ask the Booker. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to this special uh, online edition of the Pro Wrestling Report. It's Ask the Booker. Damian ATV. Nelson is sitting alongside the Booker man himself, David Hero. And in this segment, you send us your question to atb at pwrshow.com. And uh, we select one to read on air and to answer on air. And this week's question comes from Joey Salas from Honolulu, Hawaii. Joey says this, my question is related to the injury bug currently affecting the WWE. With many big name wrestlers such as Randy Orton, Rey Mysterio, Sin Cara, Alberto Del Rio, Christian and Mark Henry all being out due to injury, what young wrestlers do you see stepping up to take their spots especially with WrestleMania coming up in a few months. Great question from Joey. Take it away, David, here. Well, we've already seen the chosen three, I guess you could say. And they are? The guys that, you know, killed them on that main event. You had CM Punk, you had DBD, Zack Ryder, and then you got to throw in Wade Barrett and Sheamus, two guys that are just dominating on the SmackDown brand. And? Well, there's only five injuries. You got to fill with five spots. And, you know, Cody Rhodes. When Cody can win on both shows in the same week, will you stop it? That Why do you consider. sit here? You bury things. You bury things. You bury things. Well, you bury things. What is I your provide, problem with SmackDown? I provide facts. I have no problem with SmackDown. Sheamus and Baird are on SmackDown, and they're doing a tremendous job over there. Now they got Ginger Mahal coming in. With Ginger the, with the Cobra Clutch or the Camel Clutch Z coming up on Zoom. I mean. <laughs> Shiki baby. Shiki baby. Yeah. They need Shiki baby back with Ginger Mahal. <laughs> but I mean, they're doing a good job of building the younger studs. I mean, Daniel Bryan, yeah, they put the belt on him, but have they established him as being credible yet? Borderline. And the problem with that is because he's in a program with Big Show and Mark Henry, two giants. Right? Yeah. Okay. Then you got Punk, who is having his hands full with Dolph Ziggler. For now. For nine, well, at least for the next three weeks. You got Zack Ryder, who is busy woo, woo, woo. fooling around with Eve. Then he gets chased after by Kane. They're not too sure where they're going to go with Zack Ryder yet. He really hasn't had that. Yes, he is your U.S. champion, but has he had that moment where it's like he's finally arrived since then? They put him in some real hokey you know, scenarios right now. But they keep him next to John Cena, so he's always going to be with that babyface approval. And then you got Sheamus and you got Wade Barrett, two guys that just go out there. And it, yes, you know what? I am biased towards them. They are two of my favorite young guys, but they're so believable. You believe that those two guys could actually do some damage, could beat somebody up. And those two are our future WrestleMania headliners. Mm -hmm. That they are. You don't agree, do you? You're all salty because they didn't put Cody in the top five. Cody has to, he's in a, gonna, in a program with his brother pretty soon. Think about it. Cody has been feuding with Booker T and beating him. Repeatedly. But losing to guys on Raw. He lost to the world heavyweight champion last week. And then. Do you, how, okay, so you're saying Cody should have beat Daniel Bryan? You're saying the Intercontinental Champion should have beat the world heavyweight champion? Cody shouldn't have been put in that spot in the first place I agree. on Raw. I agree. They could have, they could have used anybody else. Like they could have Rhodes pulled equals out rating. Trent Beretta. They could have used... Um, Tyler Rex. Tyler Rex. Absolutely. Somebody else. They shouldn't have used their number four guy on the SmackDown brand. He's number four. You got Daniel Bryan. You got Big Show. You got Sheamus, Mark Henry, Wade Bar Six. He's number six on the SmackDown brand. Joey, we want to thank you for sending that question in. You can be a part of this program. ATB at PWRshow.com. ATB at PWRshow.com. Hawaii, right? Make sure you tell us your name and where you're from. Honolulu, Hawaii, yes. And Aloha Hawaii. means goodbye. Does it? That's what I was told. Do you know in some European countries, this means no and this means yes? It's like talking to you. 
Thank you so much for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. We will see you again Thursday night for Sudden Impact Radio, BWRshow.com.